Good morning, everyone. Hi. Welcome to Circle Time. But it's different today. Today you're at home and I'm at school, but there's no kids in the classroom. But I'm really excited to have Circle Time with you. So everyone, let's go over our Circle Time rules. Okay, our gimme five. Can you guys give me five? I need everyone looking at the teacher, listening, quiet mouth, hands down, and everyone sitting. Okay, you can sit on your bum, sit on a chair, or sit crisscross applesauce. Okay, let's get started. We're going to start by singing our hello song. So everyone, get your hands ready and wave with me. Willoughby, wallaby, woo. We'll say hello to you. Willoughby, wallaby, woo. everyone. We'll say hello to everyone. Hi, everyone. Can you wave and say hi? Hi and good morning. Okay, next we're going to do a little song with our fingers. And since this month we're talking about food, let's sing five fat sausages. So I need you to get your five fingers ready. Okay? One, two, three, four, five. Five fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. One went bam! Four fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. One went BAM! Okay, do it with me. Three fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. One went BAM! Two fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. One went BAM! How many sausages are left? Can you tell me? Can you show me? One! One fat sausage sizzling in a pan. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. One went BAM! Now there's no fat sausages left. That was a super fun song. Okay, next it's time to look at the calendar. And does anybody know what month it is? Hmm. Does anybody know? The month is March. It starts with the letter M, March. And what day of the week is it today? Does anybody know? Yesterday was Sunday. Sunday. Today is, guess, or tell me if you know. Today is Monday. That's right, Monday. Let's sing our days of the week song. Let's see, what action should we choose? Hmm. We could clap our hands or pat our head. I think today we should pat our head. Okay, so everyone, I need you to pat your head like this. Days of the week. 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 There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 All right, I hope you all did the actions. All right, so we need to look and see what number it is today. And it's such a big number. I can't believe it. Does anyone know this big number? I know that I see a number three and a zero. Such a big number. Today is number 30. Wow, three and a zero, 30. Let's try counting. All right, I have a pointer. So count with me if you can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Can you show me ten fingers? Ten. 
11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Whew, that was a lot of counting. And look, we have a pattern happening on our calendar. We have a shamrock, a rainbow, a shamrock, a rainbow, shamrock, rainbow. Look, today, do you know what it is today? It's a rainbow. Okay, so today is Monday, March the 30th. All right, next we're going to do some yoga. We're going to move our body. So for this, I need everyone to stand up. Can you all stand up? So stand up. And the first yoga pose we're going to do is the mountain pose. So everyone needs to stand up and stand tall like a mountain with your arms beside your legs and your hands touching your legs. And stand up nice and tall. Let's count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Nice work. Okay, let's see what our next pose is going to be. Our next one is going to be the flutterfly. So for this one, everyone needs to sit down, put your feet together, and put your hands over your feet. Okay, let's try it. So, sit on the floor. Going to try to put our feet together and then our hands over our feet. Okay, and then we can flutter our legs, legs a little bit. We can move them up and down. Perfect. Okay, let's do this a couple more times and then we can do our next pose. All right, let's see which one should we do next. A really fun one. Oh, this one's a little tricky, but I think we can try to do it. So we're going to do the timber pose. We're going to have our feet on the floor and our hands on the floor and our butt up in the air. Okay, so try it with me. Okay, put your feet apart, put your hands on the floor and your butt up in the air. And let's do this for three seconds. One, two, three. Awesome, that was great. Maybe we can just shake our bodies just a little bit. Give them a little wiggle. Okay, and we can sit back down. All right, next we're going to read our book. And we're going to read Who Ate All the Cookie Dough? And that's our book of the month. So everyone, you can find your topic board that says Who Ate All the Cookie Dough? And follow along. And you can point to the animals when we see them in the book or hear them in the book, or you can put something on the, on the animal. Here, I have a little toy cookie. So when we talk about the kangaroo, we can put the cookie on the kangaroo or we can point to it, okay? All right, who ate all the cookie dough? And I think you guys remember this book because we've read it a few times already. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Who ate all the cookie dough? Who do you think it might be? Kanga looks around to see. Lion, lion, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know, it wasn't me. Maybe zebra, let's go see. Zebra, zebra, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know, it wasn't me. Maybe
baby llama. Let's go see. Llama, llama, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe cheetah. Let's go see. Cheetah, cheetah, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe hippo. Let's go see. Hippo, hippo, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? I don't know. It wasn't me. Maybe monkey. Let's go see. Where's monkey? Monkey, monkey, do you know who ate all the cookie dough? Where is monkey? Where'd he go? Did he eat all the cookie dough? Where's monkey? Do you guys know? Can you point for me? I think that looks like it could be his tail. Hmm. Yes, no, maybe so. Monkey see, monkey do, it wasn't me. Tee hee. Then who? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. who ate all the cookie dough? Let's see. Was it zebra? Was it hippo? Was it llama? Cheetah? Lion? Monkey? Who ate all the cookie dough? Doesn't anybody know? Oh, look at Mama Kangaroo. She looks mad. She wants to know who ate all her cookie dough. We know, we know, we know who. See if you can guess it too. Who could it be? Hmm, do you know? It was, who could it be? <gasps> baby kangaroo, that sneaky baby kangaroo. Boo! Oh, that was a really fun book. Thanks for looking and listening with me. Okay, next we're going to sing a song. Let's see, what song are we going to sing? Oh, my favorite. Who's been eaten by a boa constrictor? And look here, we have a big, long boa constrictor. Let's put him down. Great. And look at our actions. Let's see, we'll put this picture out. And for this song, I need everyone to pat their legs. Yes. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. And I don't like it very much. Oh no. He's got my my toe. Toe. Everyone touch their toe. Toe. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. And I don't like it very much. Oh, gee, he's got my knee. Touch your knee. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. And I don't like it very much. Oh, fiddle. He's got my middle. Touch your tummies. Touch your tummy. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. And I don't like it very much. Oh, heck. He's got my neck. Touch your neck. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. I've been eaten by a boa constrictor. And I don't like it very much. Oh, dread. He's got my head. Everyone touch your head. Nice job. I like how you were touching your body parts when we were singing the song and patting your legs too. That was super fun. Now we have one more thing we're going to do before circle time is all done. We have an activity. 
Okay, so for our activity, I have collected some sticks because I have a job for you today. And later on, I need everyone to go outside and go for a walk with your mom or your dad or whoever's taking care of you. And you need to go and collect some sticks outside. And it might be tricky, there might be some snow on the ground, but if you go for a good long walk, you'll be able to hopefully find some sticks, just like I did, okay? And these came from a tree. So we have some sticks, and first, let's count how many sticks we found, okay? So we have one, two, three, four, five. I have five sticks. Let's see. Can you show me? Can you point to number five for me? Which one is number five? Here it is. Number five. And show me five fingers. One, two, three, four, five. five. That's right. We have five sticks. And next we're going to see which ones are longer and which ones are shorter. So let's take two to start. Okay, so we have this stick and we have that stick. Okay, which one is longer? This one is. This stick is longer than that stick. Now which one is shorter? Can you point to which one is shorter? There it is, this stick is shorter. Let's do it with a couple more sticks. Point to which one is shorter this time. Which stick is shorter? Hmm. That one. This stick is shorter. And now which one is longer? Here we go. This stick is longer. That was super fun. And we're going to do one more thing with the sticks. We're going to put them in order from shortest to tallest. Okay, let's see. This might be a little bit tricky. Let's see if we can do it. Okay, we have that one. Okay, that one's long, so I'm gonna put it at the end there. What about this one? That looks short. This one looks longer than that one. All right, this one looks longer than that one. This one's shorter. I'm going to move it to the end. There. Look. It's from the short. This one's short and this one's tall. This one's the longest and this one's the shortest. Super fun. I hope you guys had a lot of fun today. See you next time.